Mbote. Yenge Keno. No way to see me come with the Keno. Luvu Vamu. Yala. Tatan Zambi. Ingeta. They want me to do that more now. You better get used to that. Um, because they have lied about so many things. And we praise the most high. And you know, then I know those false spirits now they don't like it. <laughs> okay. We always did this as the 12 tribes, the 12 kingdoms of Congo, of the Tanzania and Pungo, the most high, the God of creation. We give honor to him. Tunama Vimpi, Namona Tatanzambi and Pungu Tulendo. Kukwisi Yambote, welcome once again. We give honor to the Most High of God of creation, Zambi and Pungu Tulendo. Yahweh Congo, no, he's not Jupiter. That's Enlil and Inki playing games once again because they are actually Jupiter and Saturn, liars. Um, the fallen angels are connected and tied to all of this. They lie about what stars are. They lie about what planets are. They're, they're teaching garbage in the schools. Uh, for the simple problem is all about the Maya Mona list. For those who don't know what the Maya Mona list is, it's the list that they say you are on when you're supposed to be worshiping the God of creation of the Messiah. This world was designed to destroy it but they're covering this up, okay? The world, the whole purpose of your life in this creation is to be a stumbling block to those who wanted to profit off of the ones who said we walk away from the most high. It was only supposed to be for a time, but the wicked shepherds that are under us have kept us out in the wilderness longer than they should have. So now it goes back to Revelation 3 and 9. I shall make them. And I told people it does not just apply to the so-called people, but it applies to everybody who thinks that they have been given the authority to replace the people. Replacement theology is crap. Rome made it up in 64 AD, and they're still making money off of it in the protest. Because, yes, the protesters are still Catholics, because if you follow the Roman calendar, you are a Catholic. I don't care what a Protestant tells me. Oh, I'm not a Catholic. If you follow the Roman calendar, you are a Catholic. It doesn't mean you follow their feast days. It doesn't mean you cross your heart or your chest. Even the Julian calendar is still Roman. It's still pagan. It's still wrong. Okay. Um, Kuswa Kongo said this, the, the, the real Jesus um, when he talked about the Babylonian and the Greek paganism that was going on, um, many prophets came and told people they were going the wrong way. The Christians themselves move the seventh day, not in ascendancy, right around the time of the first and second century. Okay, they did it themselves, it was never, and even then, it was the wrong count today. Because in 1582, they deleted, they're getting into the month where they deleted 10 days, which is the 10, the number 10 is always affiliated with Cain. Um, they moved it 10 days to create this whole concept, as the fallen angels know, of this so-called um, spinning globe and because when the aliens show up they're going to say oh they come from another planet and all this other garbage and when they wanted to hide they wanted to keep jacob out of his seasons because the only way that they can benefit from the wealth this is why people are now waking up to the fact that money is fake okay they did anything and everything possible to get us out of our rhythm Okay, it's all part of a big lie. Kimbangu, the real Kimbangu spoke about it. The real Toko spoke about it. Nobody understands that they have been taking the letters of Toko and Kimbangu and the stuff from Kimbangu and twisting it. Just to give you an idea, I was talking to an elder. Okay, the Tokuists are in cahoots with the Chinese. 
Okay, you're going to find this out really soon that China's going to get hit hard for what's going on in Africa. America is the same way. They twist in the arm of the Kimbanguists. They did so uh, during the time of Mobutu. Okay, so don't think that they're not in cahoots with a lot of this stuff. Okay, America is not what you think it is. They say, oh, you're talking. It's, it, first of all, the biggest lie of the sorcerer, there's no such thing as countries. No, they never had countries. The secret societies know that this was made up to tax you. Countries are created to tax you. That's why they set the laws of marriage. They set the laws of this. They took the most highest law so they could tax you. That's why they do the census for it. That's why they want to know how many kids you have. That's why they want to know um, what ages they are. What do you believe in? They tax you according to your religion. You do understand this. Yeah, you don't think the Muslims get taxed on their religion? Yes, they do. So does Christianity. So does Judaism. So does um, Hinduism. Um, you know, you pay taxes in every country, even in China. Okay? Everything is about the Babylonian tax code, Mesopotamian, that goes all the way back to Kemet. And was even an exploitation that they even brought it back from the time of Cain. Okay. Taxes have nothing to do with how the father wants to run his world. He, al he allowed it among his people because we still did wicked things. Okay. People do not understand. That's why Kuso Congo specifically had to say, Render unto Caesar what is Caesar's, and they, they, they kind of took this out. Render unto the Most High what is the Most High's, and render unto me what is mine. People don't even know what is Kusra Kongo's, Fuma Yusu. Christianity was created to make money. Islam was created to make money. Judaism is making money off of all of this stuff that they did. Okay? And the money that they're making is completely false. They, I told you, eating grass. They're making out of thin air. There's a sister that's talking about the fiat currency. Yes, it's all the buying and selling of what they do not own. Every single African leader that ran to China is going to pay for it. Because China is going to get paid hard because the most I said you do not sell my inheritance to Jacob this is why Esau is pretending to be Jacob to make East Jacob sell his own inheritance Toko already fixed that they're acting like it didn't happen now they're going to pay for it Simon Toko Maya Mona never replaced Masindisi, Kuswa Congo, Isaiah. No. Simon Kimbangu did not either. Neither did Matswa, neither did Padi, neither did Kempavita, neither did none of these people replaced him. Kepa, Saola, <clears throat> they never, Paul is the sorcerer. He never changed him to Paola. I was talking to the elders. Saola literally means, as I've learned, one who interprets. They took that whole thing, and now they're speaking in tongues, talking about interpreter. You're not even speaking in tongues right. Christianity is a scam. Islam is a scam, and Judaism is a big scam. All three of those were created. <clears throat> All three of those were created. By Esau. We never were called no Christians. None of us were that followed the Messiah. That name was created by Rome, by the Pope, by Pontificus, what do you call it? Uh, Christis, Osiris Christis, by the way. They used to, they took that name out. Pontificus Osiris Christis. Christianity is the worship of Nimrod. 
That's why you don't see the phallic all over the place. The Statue of Liberty is Sol Invictus in a dress. But you want to keep believing these secret society people telling you, no worry, when they go running around doing stuff you don't even know. Okay? You have no idea you are talking to the sun god pirate and he is taking you to the pit of Apollyon. Doing wishes. Do you think these lower level masons are going to find out you are part of the scam to destroy the wheat? This is exactly what the, 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 the rich people were wanting to do is to make sure nobody goes into the day of rest and nobody gets the inheritance. If they can't, it's that whole mindset. If we can't have it, you can't either. So then who keeps it? That's what that's the that's the whole that's where Lucifer has deceived the whole world with the wealthy elites. No, there's a list, and Cain can never, they never learn. You could they could not destroy the animals. That's why they made up all the crap about oh, there was no Noah's Ark, there was this and that. Quit, keep listening to these Anunnaki's. They're all a bunch of liars. Black, white, whatever the heck they look like, they're all thief. <laughs> okay? They're thief. For the Tata Congo, they are thief. Okay? Let me get the music started. All praises. Um, I'm going to say this. Ki Nkanda Watanga, what book have you read? Wakanda has nothing to do with no Africa stuff. Wakanda is what created the world. The Nkanda, what they call the Tula, the scriptures, they want to say Torah because they worship in Amun Ra. Okay, Ra, Ra is all about Ray. All they did was put the W on the N. So you don't understand. Ray, R-A-Y, is all about Sol Invictus, man. Kintangu, Wasikama, oh wait. Mono Nkanda, Wanzambi Yetanga. I have read God's word. DD. I'm going to talk about Sean Puffy Combs. Why he why they changed why it was really changed to P. Diddy. <laughs> Boy, you're gonna fall out, man. I'm telling you, these people out here don't even understand. That's why when you had uh Tyler Perry calling himself Madia, the name Madia means food and Eddie. D D and Eddie come from each other. It means they could they eating you spiritually and also physically. The most high, I wanted to put that long ladies thing, I, I lost it. The most high destroyed the world because they were eating each other. Okay, they still, they're doing it now. As you will soon find out. They're just not telling you. All right. Let me, let me get the stream going. They're still eating people. Consuming human flesh is the highest form of witchcraft. Because they say that you, you you take in the power of your enemy. Okay, it's all it's all cover up. Oh, sorry, my back is acting up today again. All right, so here we go. Again, I don't own the rights. This is I do not own any rights to any music. This is for the not for redistribution of any kind but only for the edification of this channel. Thank you. 
Praises Kimball, Kimmel, and Tutan Zombie. You know, um, I hope that you were with Kichila once again. Or um, I was going to say, I lost my page. I'm still. Zolele, Kutuvivile, do you want to listen to us? It's up to you. Either Elo, Unzolele, Kunuvivila, or Ve. Uh, Kana Unzolele, Kunvivila Ko. I hope I'm saying that right. That means I don't want to listen. But it's up to you. Um, why does Rome have priests and nuns take vows of celibacy? People don't even know has nothing to do with the Bible. <laughs> the concept of marriage has to do with taxing and inheritance and beneficiaries. When you become a priest, Rome owns all of your assets, including what your family will give to you as an inheritance. The same thing when you become a nun. So... When you become a nun, now Rome inherits everything that you are given to by your family members, okay, because they become the beneficiary of your property. That's one of the reasons why they encourage this among the Banabe to Avisolene. When, they, when we became under the Catholic Church in 18, 1485, when they discouraged marriage, and they wanted to also in, in, uh, in, interfere with polygamy, which the father is not against it, but you have to have the, do it the right way. There's people out here that are doing it way wrong, <laughs> okay? The next thing is <clears throat> um, it was about taxes. The whole thing about being married to one wife which I'm not saying that, you know, this is the, the Rome made up the rule about marriage. They, they did it two ways. One, they, they misinterpreted the Bible. <laughs> One. Two, they made it to where the state benefits. I was listening to this guy who talked about why Alabama supposedly doesn't give out marriage licenses anymore is because they say you do it through God's law or Christians are never getting married the right way because the Benabito of Isola, they did not get married in the fashion that they do in these churches. No. You can go watch a Congolese wedding. <laughs> you can go watch many Bantu weddings. Okay. They're still doing the most size way of marriage 
that even in the slavery days, we had to make some stuff up because they wouldn't let us do it anymore. Okay. But the Banabeto of Isolade, the, the former slaves, the African slaves that they brought from the kingdom of Congo and Totala, that they brought from the Banabeto of Isolade, we knew how to do the marriage the right way. Just because you go before the priests and you say, I'm getting married, does not mean your marriage is recognized in the kingdom of the father. No. For one, you have he, ha, he does not even acknowledge the Christian church right now since the 1480s. He did not approve of us marrying to any other nations. It's even in the scriptures where he said, even in your captivity, we stay away. That's why in the 1800s, when we were still trying to practice that, they forced segregation on us. It's a huge lie. We did not want to integrate. It's a lie. They had to use the Masons to do that. That's why the Masons went and made up all this stuff about Plessy versus Ferguson. They intentionally sabotaged us because we wanted to go home. There are many of us who said, we want to go home back to really worship our father. The interference started with those of Revelation 3 and 9 who said, no way. If the, if the Christians find out the truth, we're broke. That's exactly what took place. They said, if the, if the Europeans find out the truth, we are broke. It destroys our banking system. It destroys Rome. It destroys everything. Okay. Now they're claiming they want to start quote unquote arresting people for spreading false information. Well, then they need to arrest themselves. Because for one, there are no countries and they know it. Everything, I can even prove it to you that they lied to you through the Bible. There's only this. Through the Bible, I can tell you that they lied to you. We're going to go to Revelation 17. This is all there is. There are no countries. This is what they have. Uh, I'll do it NIV for those, you know, stuck in this deception. You're already in the beast. You are in the prostitute. They're, that's why I said they need to start arresting themselves because you are, you are pagans, and they know it. One of the seven Maliki Congo who have seven bowls came and said to me, come. See, they don't even tell you the correct name. That's why I say Asalama Maliki Congo. Islam does not say it right because they're not, they're not, they're not telling the truth. Okay. Christianity could never say it because you don't even know that you're you're under the, the halo dragon. Okay, Judaism for sure they know it. They know that you're not talking, you're not connected to the right Messiah. I'm even going to show you the word for adultery that you're saying it every day going to your Zumba class. Because Bazumba is what adultery is. So when you keep saying Zumba, you're breaking the commandments. And they know it. Of taking the father's name in vain, of committing adultery. They know that the church is committing adultery every Sunday. Because he never, we never changed anything. Toko came. He tried to change it back. They kept trying to kill him. And then they sent out false letters. So when he got out of prison, he had to start over because the father knew, first of all, the Sunday that you're worshiping on is not even the correct day of the week. It's actually Wednesday. That's why I told people, technically it's Sunday and Wednesday. I told people that the whole thing is Wednesday, Sunday, it's the middle of the week, Monday to, or well, Monday, I say it's Monday, Tuesday, because they took 10 days. They started on what they called the Friday. No, they started on what they called the Thursday. They counted 10 days and deleted it. I'll even show you. Okay, the Gregorian calendar is not even right. This is what Wikipedia, you can look this up, it's not fake. Okay, the Gregorian calendar 
It's used in most parts of the world. I say most because the rest of them know they all still off, but <laughs> they know it's wrong. It went into effect in October. Why is October so big deal? Because that's the, the month that the Babylonian worship Lucifer as sin or what they call Shamash. Okay. The papal bull enter, okay, bull enter visa is all is that's all bail issued by Pope Gregory. Okay. This dude was this dude was fabrication to the core which introduced as a modification and a replacement for the Julian calendar. The Julian calendar was created by Julius Caesar, not by the Most High creation, no. The principal change was the space leap years. The problem is we did not have these days. This is why when they took out the book of Jubilees that Christians don't read it, it says, if you follow the way of the heathens, you want to always go six days too soon. Yeah, they know that. So then what happens is now you sin and they get your inheritance because you're breaking the father's law. And it's because they know you break one law, you break them all. They know that. Okay. The Christians are always breaking the first commandment. I don't care what they're going to tell you. I don't care what they think their pastor is saying. And his 501c3 and all the tax codes that they use across the world, they know they're breaking the first commandment because you don't exist. The countries, you think the UN exists to the most high, you fool yourself. He don't see that place. It was made in San Francisco in 1945. It's an abomination. It's the B system. Okay? All the UN is working for Lucifer. Now it's kind of funny, like I said, the president happens to be from Cameroon, which is the capital of Yaounde, which means Judah. Because they know that the center of Africa is the tribe of Judah. Okay? That's why the Esau's up there with all of his spies and everything that he's doing, with all of his bought-off people that he keeps bribing them. And yes, the Catholic Church is going to get kicked out of there. Oh, yeah. And all the people that's, that's doing Jesuit stuff. Okay, differently so as to make the average calendar 365, which that was not ours, because the problem is you had two different luminaries. You had the you had Semyaza, and then you had the Most High Son. Okay, Semyaza was stuck up there. That's why when NASA had to go, when they had to make their so-called, you can go look it up. This is not a lie. I'm not telling you the truth. You can go look up the NASA Sun pattern. It's right there in the Library of Congress. Okay, when Semyaza came down, they had to replace him because he was only up there for 70 generations. All the fallen angels came back besides Azazel. He cannot come out. That's why they're trying to protect it to where he's guarded, to where nobody can touch him in what they want to call Antarctica. Okay, and all of that stuff that's outside of the outskirts with all the Anunnaki cities. Well, yeah, they take people to do, oh, my gosh, the most horrible things. Yeah, you keep loving those creatures. They keep jacking people up, man. They're the one that want to arrest people for false information because Tatanzami is about to jack them up. He's going to expel all of them. And there ain't nothing they could do about it because you said you think they're all powerful and strong and powerful. You ain't seen the most high yet. You haven't seen Micaiah. Micaiah goes like this, too. Woo! When he celebrates the most high. When I talk about Micaiah, I'm talking about the Archangel Michael. Okay? <clears throat> they all do it. And then the way they dance, they do the whining, they do, man, they don't dance like those people up in these churches talking about, uh, uh, uh. no, they created that type of music for the women. And then they started feminizing the energy of the men so you move the same way. So you're moving with that feminine energy of the false Messiah's mother. Not the feminine energy of the most high's mother because the feminine energy of the most high's uh, wife or, you know, is going to make you lift up in the, in the spiritual realm to where you can manifest 
like they they mock you on Superman. Yeah, you're gonna see that, but it's gonna be coming from the other side. Yeah, it ain't gonna be funny. Every year that exactly divisible in four leap year, except for years that are acceptable divisible by a hundred. See, they made it up. This is why they, they fulfilled the scriptures. If the days had not been shortened, and it talks about if your life had not been shortened, then no one would be saved. Because they're playing games. It is not 2024. See, look at all these different variations. I told her sister, we just hit the new year. All you got to do is they're going to show you in Kenya. Uh, where is it? Mm, did they take it off? Yeah, the Igbo calendar. <laughs> yeah, you see what this is? 1024 to 1025. Why do you think the Igbo are saying that? See now, the, he, the, I told his sister, the Ethiopian calendar, it just turned 2016. This is the year that we're in. That's why they did it in the movie Back to the Future. Okay? We are nine years ahead of where we're supposed to be. That's why he said when they, when the guy who made the Back to the Future said Donald Trump is Biff Tannen. Donald Trump was not born in 1947. <laughs> You're going to find this out. He wouldn't have been frozen for that long, but no, he was born in 1938. So was Hillary Clinton, by the way. They say she was born out. No. They both are men. I'm telling you, they know how to play this game. If anything, they would have switched bodies. The movie The Omen is about Donald Trump. Uh, actually, yeah, him. Because The Omen came out around the same, the, the 60s and the 70s, okay? And, of course, we know about Barron. We ain't going to get into that. Why, where the name Baron even comes from is Lucifer, okay? A lot of these names you're calling on, you don't even get it. And your lady or anybody called Jared, they mock in what happened with Cain, like his um, bro, his son, his son-in-law. But we ain't gonna get. They know it's a common knowledge thing, and they'll tell you the firstborn of the Jewish people is inverted. The, the man become the woman, the woman become the man. That's not a lie. So they can't say that's false because they know they do it. <laughs> They'll tell you, yeah, we know, okay? They do it. They invert the firstborn. So that's why you, you don't even get it, okay? They do that for their spiritual mother that they worship the, the, the goat god who is both male and female. And they want this androgynous thing to continue among all the whole. You don't understand. Because you worship the beast, whether you know it or not, you are automatically putting yourself into the androgynous agenda. Where you're inverting your firstborn to the opposite. This is why many people are struggling with their sexuality now. And why many people are having a hard time defeating the demon of lust and other demons, anger, whatever you want to call it. This has been going on for generations now. Because they wanted Jacob, they wanted the Banabed to Abisola to kill each other. The way that the Tanzami caused them to kill each other. Okay, that's all part of it. So now... The woman, there's a, they saw a woman sing on a scarlet beast that has now come out. You're going to find that out. I told you, go look up the name of, of her name, what Kamala stands for. Okay? Donald Trump and Kamala Harris are on the same side. <laughs> They're on the same, Joe Biden and Joe Biden and Donald Trump are on the same side. They go sitting in the back laughing. <laughs> okay? Um. You think that Obama and them are enemies, man, they, the only reason why they don't like Donald Trump is because of what they said right there on the movie Back to the Future. We don't want the McFly family to go to prison because they know that's his job that the Most High has anointed him for. 
is like King Cyrus. That doesn't mean he's with the most high. It just means he's like he's like um how uh like Putin is like 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 um Alexander the Greek and all these other people. The father used leaders just like with Ramses. Ramses was still praying to Amun Ra, but he still said, Let my people, he said, let the people go. What they're a threat for, what Donald Trump is a threat for is he knows that the people that's the people that he works for are Esau. Are, the, are actually, because I listened to this guy, he said, we have to destroy America because they are Amalek. They are Esau, is how they say it. First of all, the Phoenicians are the ones that were saying it, Esau. We said Esway. That's really how you say his name, Esway. Now, Esau is Esau, okay? That's why you Esau. See, when they when they took Isaiah, because that's how you really say his name, it's not Isaiah. It's Isaiah, and they sawed him asunder. That was because... That's because they had the spirit of Esway. That's how we always keep doing this. We are not him. Even though he was Mukongo, he turned against the Most High. Okay? He was Mukongo. If you think he's not, watch the Tatanga, I'm going to show you. Yakubi Isaele. Because, see, they, they, his name, all his name means is I love you. That's insolently. But his way, his name was in Simba because he took the firstborn place. That's why Esau wants to be in Simba, which means firstborn. Okay, so in Simba is what he thinks he is. In Zuzi means judge. In Ganganvala, okay, in Ganganzambi, the world thinks that they are with the god of of Abeli, Abel. Okay. And they keep telling this lie about oh the, the, the Bible story of Cain and Abel, uh, the Seth and Osiris is older. No, man, Seth and Osiris is Esau and Nimrod. Quit listening to these evil twin lies, because Abel and Cain are way older than those two. That's their grandfather. <laughs> That's Osiris and Seth's grandfather and, and he grandfather and he kill it. Yo, you keep listening to them Egyptian gods. You're gonna see what's gonna keep. You're going to Anubis. They don't care. Be careful, like I said. I know someone was talking about Anu. I was like, that was the Bob. That's a man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show it to you. That's not Thambi and Pungu. That's not King Congo. That's what Nimrod called on. Okay? So, you know, that's the thing. Those That's all Masonic. All right. The woman was dressed in purple scarlet, was um, oh, a golden cup filled with abominable things in the filth of adulterers. The name written on her forehead was a mystery. Babylon the Great. And I did the teaching where it tells you how to say, I'll actually bring it up in Kikongo again if we need to. The mother of prostitutes and the abomination of the earth. Ask your pastor this question. What is her name? Yeah, they're not going to answer that. Not if they want to keep the church because they do watch them. They're not going to answer that. What is her name? You think Christians think they know everything. Okay, what is the name of the prostitute? Oh, they just told us this. Oh, they yes, they know. They just told you that because they know her name. What is the name of the woman that is drunk with the blood of God's holy people? What is her name? Now, this is where she tricked you. The blood of those who bore the testimony of Jesus. Jesus is her son. The woman that is drunk with the blind. Tatanzambi never named his child. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob never gave his son the name Jesus. No. 
why would he name his son after the Greek god of fertility that they called Isus? Man, you people don't know what Rome did. That's Apollo. He never named him that. So now she tricked you. The woman, the woman that's making you drunk with the wine of the saints has now taught you talking to her son. And she put her, they put her name in there. This name did not exist. As a matter of fact, you go back 500 plus years, it's not even spelled with a J. Why do you think they covered that up? Because they know that I-E means that is and sus means pig in Latin. Iesus means that is pig. In Latin, you go translate it, I-E, that is sus, pig. I-E means that is that's why it said I E I dot E dot S U S P Seuss. So you're actually insulting the real Messiah as you're honoring the fake one. Okay. Yeah, they know, but they ain't going to tell you that. That's why you're only doing half of the work. This, the name Jesus is a stumbling block to Jacob because the most High did not name him that that's not who. The Sanhedrin's laughing at you because they know who they crucified, and they're going to say, oh, his name was Yeshua. They added the H for Horus because they were worshiping Tammuz. It was Yeshua, <laughs> and it was named after Yosua, okay? And it was actually pronounced Isu. It, uh, like they say uh, in a song, Esu, Esu Wananzambe, Mundele, okay? No, Esu... Esu is not Mundele, but neither was the fake one either. He wasn't Mundele either. <clears throat> they found the reason why they took Cesare Borgia or anyone that resembled him and put that image up there is because he looked like Cain. That's why they did it. So now you're crying over Cain crucified and they're laughing at you. Because Cain Cain was melanated, so was Abele. <laughs> Cain is li lying to you. Black pe I told white people then they come from what happened with Atlantis. Jacob, the one that came from the, the sin that took place, the Anunnaki who was spawned, he wanted the white, the, the, the image of the white gods that the most high cursed the watchers with to become the dominant image. That's why they took the image of Jupiter. That was still worshipped by the by the by and said of oh, Saturn, okay, and said this is the most high. And that's why the father said, do not be like the Canaanites. They have the curse backwards. <laughs> okay, the darker skinned people are not the curse. That's the lie. Okay. This calls for mine with wisdom, the seven heads, the seven hills, which the woman sits. These are also seven kings. That is still the way it is today. They still going off the seven hills. They have them in Rome. They got them in New York. Anywhere you find seven hills, they're putting this stuff up. The 10 horns you saw are 10 kings that have not received a kingdom. Now they have. They have received their kingdom. And they sit in there laughing at you because they're making money off of this lie. And they, with one person, will give power to the authority of the beast. Everybody keeps saying Rome is the beast. Yes, and partially correct. Cain is the beast. But then you sit in there, they got the name in front of you. Walk. Why you think you're a cripple? You become cripple worshiping Cain. That's why you need the walking Cain. That's why you need, you eating candy Cain on Christmas. That's why you do everything with Cain, sugar Cain, hurricane, lighter Cain, uh, coke Cain. They know McCain. That means son of. 
Okay, son of Mac, Mac means son of. You know, we had a coach I knew, the Colorado son of Cartney. That's what Mac Cartney means. Okay, this is all about the Scottish and Spanish. You don't even get it. The father has nothing to do with this stuff. All of these things about when they have up these um, uh, name plates and you know. Uh, what they call him? Um, uh, yeah, yeah. I lost my train of thought. <clears throat> you know these. Um, mm, 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 mm. Wow, why am I losing my train of thought? Sorry, it'll come back to me. You know these these like uh, like the, I know the House of Bailey. They have the uh, coat of arms. The father's like, I don't have nothing. When you find out where the word coat comes from, it's a Kikongo word. Kota. Okay, if I put it up in the Kikongo, Kota. See, this is going to prove my point right here. Land of milk. I'm going to get to the land of milk and honey. Exodus. Watch this. I'm going to tell you, show you where you now get the word Haiti from. It means Hittites. Monotu kulumoka sambuna kungulusa bona maboko ya bantu ya esipti na esipiti or ngipiti in p kubi sisa. See, this is how he said esipiti. Bit bono in si yina sambu na kunata and they also said kamata. Bona because of kemet. Okay, kemet is how he said kamata. <laughs> In C Mosi ya umbote, in P ya nene, in C ya miliki, tibuiki kelemingi, territory ya bantu, ya kanana, ya bunt bantu, ya heti, hetites. Okay, that's why they're mocking the country, heti. Because you following, the, we went after when they fought against the colonization, they were fighting against the Hittites. <laughs> Deception, all the way down to Canaan. Man, all the laws go back to Canaan, Mesopotamia. Yabantu ya Amori. See, now you see where they get the word the Amorites is Amori. Yeah, that's Italian for love, right? Yabantu, ya perisi, yabantu, ya heave, heave, ho, heave, okay? In pi, yabantu, ya busi. Yeah, that's why you ride in the bus. Jebusites. Double Dutch bus coming, okay? Ya busi is where you get the word bus from. That's why you got to get bus fare to go down and nobody have a car. Okay, you don't get it. Everything they make money off of, even poverty. Okay, now the land of milk and honey, and I, I, I can pull it up right here. Kachopia, Ethiopia was the whole sub-Saharan Africa. Not this little clutch piece of thing they did. Okay, the whole reason why they created the boundaries is for taxing people. And for each corporation or whatever they set up to get their portion. They did the same thing with South America. There was no boundaries. They made states have boundaries for taxation purposes. <laughs> Canada is the same way. And of course, you see Russia and all these other places. Why you think they, they, they don't put in the still got boundaries? You think he ain't charging no tax? Get out of here. Now, Nork, Norka, Light, the Akan. This is the, this is the hobby. This is um, what they call it, the Sahel. Region, why do you think it is Burkina Faso the upright people? 
Why do you think they said that? Because Naguer, it doesn't mean what they're calling you now. It meant kings. You see Kemet here? Kusi, the father of Nimrod. Punti. Now, why do you think they this, they, they erased? They, they took Kanani. This is uh, this is where Azania is now. Nzambe. That means almighty. Okay? This, all of the, the whole world belongs to this God. Kanani. They, they got this 200 BC. Man, science was created by Cain. Okay? To hide the fact that those creatures that you keep digging up out of the ground were hybrids created by the Anunnaki. And they did the mockery in the movie Transformers when they terraformed the earth to do what they want. And I was, yeah, okay. That was the terraforming that they did to make the most high mad. <laughs> okay. This is what they're lying about. See, the Magi. You think the Magi was up in here? Okay. No. They were down in here. Kuso Congo was born in South Africa, Azania. It didn't used to be called South Africa. It was called Azania. Okay? They went up here to Kamata to run away from Her Helodi, who was ruling at that time in this region. Not up here. This is where the Turks and this is where they ran later. Okay? Now, I, I honor the people talking about this, but like I said, the one thing that's going to get people struck down by the Most High is when you capitalize on what is supposed to be free to the chosen. Free. Kuso Kongo meant it when he said, freely you receive, freely you give. There's a way for the Most High to make your money that he can give it to you. But then if you turn around and you sell the bread, now nah, you're going to have problems. This is where people are getting hit with sorcery. Churches are full of sorcerers because they're selling the bread. Yeah, they are. It don't mean if they non profit my foot. You still profit. You're profiting off of the, the stumbling block to Yakubi. Because Esau is telling his own people, you are Yakubi. Yeah, try it again. And also... There's a mixture there, black, white. There's black and white Canaanites. Okay, they know they're not. They're the same type of stuff because they 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 practice in secret. They go and they do all their Canaanite rituals behind closed doors, including passing the fire over to Baal. You think they don't wait till the Most High show you? All right. The Ten Horns, they have one purpose. They will wage war against the Lamb. The Lamb that they're waging war against is Yesu Mwananzambe. The Sorcerer is the one waging the war. He is the one who wrote the Bible and put everything, put us in there. That's why they're mocking you when they called it the Book of Clarence. Because the twin brother of Tama was bribed to be Masindasi. And he was one of us. Okay? That's why Tatanzami said our worst enemy is the Banabeto of Isolele. So then when you see the Hebrew Israelites and all the stuff that they keep saying, that comes from him, one of us. Where he is pretending to be the Most High uh, Temple and he's lying and he bewitched the heathen to where now they are praying to Apollo and they don't even know it. And anyone who comes and tells you otherwise, you're crazy, you're conspiracy theorists, they want to take you out. Because the reality is, even with Kimbangu and Toko, they all said we use one spirit. Even though it's seven different spirits divided. Okay. Nobody, how many people even know why he made seven spirits? I like to say, how many people actually know that? What does the seven spirits significant mean? And why were there seven churches? And because each church represents one of these seven spirits. 
Yeah, how many Christians know that? That's why each of the seven churches had a different mission than the other, but they all worked under the one spirit. Yeah, the, the, the imposters know that. You see, there, there's no, the, all these people that say, I'm Catholic, I'm Protestant, I'm this, I'm, I'm Methodist, I'm Baptist, I'm this, I'm that, I'm uh, Orthodox. You fool yourself. You are deceived. Because there's only seven, there were seven spirits, one spirit, seven churches, never changed. Never changed nothing. I'm telling people. They're still like that in the kingdom. The seven lampstands, that's what they want to now call the menorah. Okay? The menorah is not even a word we use. We call it noka. Menorca, Manorca, more than one light. Okay, Ma means plural, Norca, light. There's no such word as Menorah. Ra, once again, is Amun Ra. Menorca. That's how we say it. Manorca. That's why the word, that's why people, children say Monica. You know, you change it, they hide in it. That means many lights. Monica. Manoka. <laughs> that's what the more that's the word, that's the real word for menorah. They took the R, the K, and put an R there for menorah. It's Manoka. Yeah, keep believing these things, people. We didn't say no menorah. It's manoka. Many lights, seven lights. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. The Maliki said the waters, what we call Mai or Masa, Maza, you saw where the prostitute sits are peoples. Multitudes, nations, and languages. What he saw was the whole world under the spell of the, of the sorcerer, of the witch. The beast and the ten horns you saw will hate the prostitute. They will bring her to ruin and leave her naked. That is what you're seeing is happening right now. The nations, they say, oh, America's a liar because America technically represents this kingdom. They don't even know it. It came out, okay, the seventh kingdom came out of the, the eighth kingdom came out of the seventh kingdom. The seventh kingdom was Britain, okay? The tenth kingdom that you're going to witness for them is the, the new world order. Yeah, we have nothing to do with that. Our ninth kingdom, that's why when Prince said 2000, zero, zero party, I'm going to party like it's 1999. What he's encouraging you to do is to not focus on the fact that 999 is the real kingdom and you're under 666. So I'm partying out out of time. 999 means the king of the most high is going to jack you up because his name, Prince, is Kosana. That's what Hosanna means. Okay? And he knew... His lineage is Bantu. Okay. His father had it. His mother was something else. She actually was, um, I think she was, yeah, she was either Arabic or Jewish descendants of the um, Tagarma and all those. Okay. So you have a lot of mixing that went on. Yeah, and the, and all the abuse that we keep doing to each other, and a lot of people don't know, like they talk about what happened with his mother and his father. That is called mental illness from the fact that we are in the wrong spirit. So, of course, that drove him to become into the music that actually turns you into a warlock because you do go in a trance. He learned the same skills like from Michael Jackson. And all the others, 
Quincy Jones and everybody else, Motown, um, the guy, uh, the Atlanta Records, um, Ray Charles and everybody else, uh, Little Richard. What you're doing is you're putting people in a mantra. They made this happen as part of the Truman Show when they turned the television and the music industry into your, uh, what they want to call snake eyes. Okay? You're too busy paying attention to other things than what you really should be doing. And the, because when, um, when they started creating the industries, this goes back, you know, the, the Mexicans have just celebrated their Independence Day from the 1800s, 1810 to be exact. Okay, they don't understand that many of those dances that you see them doing, my wife used to actually do it, okay, because there are dark, yeah, they're dark, there's black Mexicans, people don't understand this, okay, much of what they are doing is mixed with our culture, because it's the Spanish mixed with the Banabetu dances that, it, that incorporates much of the drums that they did with Native Americans have the similarities. So they took these different types of playing the musical instruments and incorporated it into a European construct. What that was meant to do was to keep you dancing, keep them singing, keep them having fun while we're robbing you, <laughs> okay? This is why Rome created carnivals and festivals so that you were not paying attention. And then of course the sporting events were then incorporated later on, which is a repeat of what they did back in the day. They always did these Coliseum things so that you were too busy focusing on the fact that your government was robbing you all the time. This was always the concept that Lucifer used throughout generations to make a sport out of everything, okay? That's why when I talked about the golden cup before in the hand, filming abominable things and filth of her adulteries, that's everything that is against the opposite of the father. Okay? And many of us are dealing with this problem because when Toko came to say, give me back the church, okay? And people talk about, oh, well, Lucifer... No, Lucifer challenges every single messenger. If you haven't seen that yet, you're blind. He challenges every single messenger. Does he still do what the Most High tell him to do? Okay, yeah. But see, we willing, see the problem is we gave him the authority over us when we gave away the inheritance to his kingdom. So you're kind of, you're demanding your inheritance from him while you're worshiping him. Okay, that don't happen. But he don't tell you that. This is the game that they're playing on you. You got Christians out here. We want our inheritance for Jacob. It's like, but the, the Bible, it says, says, but you got to go through Jacob. So then the people who you're, who are talking to you and you see the exploitation that's going on right now, what are they doing? They're charging you empty hand, exchanging nothing for something. Okay. Because this is what Cain does. This is what Esau does. He's playing a trick on you. This is what they do. You're exchanging something for nothing. And you're living up the good life, acting like, oh yeah, this can buy nice cars. This can buy a nice house. This is everything. Now it's going to come that the zombie with the purge is getting rid of the rich. The wealthy elites are going to be gone. 
That's why they're sitting here throwing all these parties and galas and you're attending them. And, oh, yeah, we're going to hang out with this guy. The word DD, P. Diddy means food. Because they're showing you that they consumed you just like in the days of Noka. This is how it was. Partying, drinking, having a good time, doing whatever you wanted and thinking that you're with the most high. It was the same way while they were also consuming people. They just hid that part so that's not in plain sight. So you wouldn't know that you are in the same position because it was always about the destruction of the people on the list. See, they are all going to be jealous of the people who are under the Congo star. When they don't have it. So they're going to play you for a sucker to make you spend for something that is yours. And now the Tatan Zombie says, now they're going to pay for it. Because everything that for the chosen is free from the Most High. The chosen ones do not pay for anything from Esau. This is the lie. Okay? And now they're going to get hit. Because he's capitalizing and he's using all the people to capitalize on Jacob's trouble. That started a long time ago. That's why you got all these people up in these uh, CIA created, uh, or, or not CIA, but, you know, um, Masonic creations going in circles. And they themselves are going to get the short end of the stick very soon. Because Satan can't pay you. It is not his. At the end of the road, you're going to get worse than when you were living under these secret societies. Because you created the stumbling block. And you're participating in it. And you're standing up there gloating. Oh, yeah. Okay. Kamala Harris. Is sitting up there, all oh, my sorrows. Okay, I have told my mom this. I'm just like, y'all don't understand. The Boule sold us out in 1904 and before that. Okay, because we never learned this concept envy not the way of the oppressor and do nothing according to his, his ways. You don't understand everybody, even the white people, they have their own people that have sold them out. <laughs> okay? They're going to find this out. Them rich white people standing up there, they sold out their own people. Okay? The Asians, the same way. Indian, whatever you want to call them. The age group of individuals, there's 70 tribes, they sold each other out. For these galas and these nice paintings and Fabergé egg and, oh, we're going to live the good life. Oh, yeah. All of them under blood oath. Every last one of them is under the blood oath. They have taken children under the blood oath. And now they want to tell you it's a lie. Oh, we want to arrest you for that. No, they need to arrest themselves. But see, now the father said he going to take care of all the corruption of law enforcement because he's going to expose every last corrupt police force in the world. Yeah, watch what's going to happen. Because the real judges are coming now. And I'm talking Toko, the real Toko, the real Kimbangu, the real, the real, the real priests are coming. Okay, the real scriptures are going to start showing you who's who out here. Okay, I told you, your three, every single African leader who went to China is going to pay for it. 
I'm, t- I'm like, woo, it's going to get bad. Because China cannot save us. The most I can use China, oh yeah, but even in their own culture, they have this thing called, I forget, Ben something, it says let it rot. The young people right now are fighting against Chinese authority. They don't even want to serve in the military no more. Yeah, you think it's not coming apart for them? You better believe it. Okay? The same thing everywhere. The Most High has stirred up exactly like what he says. I'm stirring up this. I'm stirring up that. Okay? Watch what's going to happen over these next few months. The Ipaseka is in a couple of weeks. The real one. The Passover. There's two Passovers we know, okay? Now, all those who think they're not serving the Anunnaki, whether they know it or not, are going to find out exactly what they have been doing to those who are trying our best to break us out of this concept of profiting on Jacob's trouble. Yeah, it's over for them. You're profiting off of Jacob's trouble, and you know you're worshiping these gods. Okay? And I'll bring them all back up because they right here. I'm going to show you ANU is not who you think he is. Okay? That is not Tatanzambi. Okay, the ancient Mesopotamians believed that their deities lived in heaven. Does that change for any one of these people? But that a God's statue was a physical embodiment of God himself. As such, a cult statues were given constant care and attention. Oh, does that not sound familiar? <laughs> and a set of priests were assigned to tend to them. Uh, yeah, and the churches are doing it right now. They just put them into paintings and all this other stuff. These priests would close the statues. Uh, yeah, now they make the, they do the um, you know, the, the curvatures and they make they do the clay and everything and place the feast for them so they could eat. This goes back right to the, the, the scriptures that they took out where the apocalypse of Abana, where he had to go make these things. And he had to do just that. He had to go put food in front of these statues. When you go to pray in front of these false gods, you are the food in front of the statues. So you are the AD. You are the DD. Okay? You are the Madia. A deity's temple is believed to be that deity. Liberal, uh, the gods had boats, full size barges which were normally stored inside the temples. And of course, this is all incorporated with Nimrod and were used to transport their cult statues along run waterways. You see the people, they carry in the the, the the Maria. It's no different than the Christians walking around with the cross. That's not what saves you. Oh, you don't even get it. I'm telling you, they made it to where you worship in the, the, the physical things more than what really saves you. Holding up the cross don't do nothing. Wearing the cross around your neck don't do jack. You don't get it. You don't have to show people who you are if you know who you are. Tattooing your body. It even says it in the scriptures, oh, yeah, tattooing. Oh, but the, the law. No. The desecration of the temple is very much a problem that you don't even understand. Okay? It's all Babylonian deception. Sometimes the deity cult statue would be transported location of a battle so that the deity could watch the battle unfold. Guess who the statue is now? (laughs) Guess who the statue is now? You! 
because they 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 messing up your head with yoga and all this. Oh, yeah, yeah, I took that Kusa, the, Simon the Sorcerer, the one doing yoga. Yes, you might. Yes, you do uh, need to to meditate on the word. What word are you meditating on? The major deities of the Mesopotamian pantheon were believed to participate in the assembly of gods. Okay, just because Rome took you to a monotheistic mindset doesn't mean they are. We were monotheism, but we had the, all the Malikis of Congo were seen as gods. We had Tatanzambi as the highest, and Zambisi is the feminine side of Tatanzambi. Okay? Tata Mwana Mwanda. Okay? But the deception is many people don't know how they try to get you to blasphemy. The Holy Spirit is part of this deception. And the secret societies know that is the objective. You blaspheme, the, he said, you blaspheme the Mwanda, you're not saved in any place. Okay. Now, the longest list is a text entitled An. Or A N U M, a Babylonian scholarly work listing the names of the two thousand deities. Okay, there's two thousand deities that now are calling themselves the Most High. That's where he said, "Who are you, L E G I O N? We are many, but he was in one person. They were in one person. This is what the sorcerer was. These two thousand deities. Okay." While sometimes the sacred regard simply lists of Sumerian gods with their Akkadian equivalents. Hollywood is filled with this garbage. The churches are filled with this garbage. The world is deceived with magician deception of lying signs and wonders. Praying in, to the wishing well God the genie in the lamp, thinking that they're going to get your prayer answered. How do you get it? The term usually referred to the merit of heaven and earth endowed with immense powers who believe to decree the fates of mankind. That has not changed with the heathen, y'all. We are praying the 12 tribe, the Bakongo, the Banabetisuli, we are praying to the heathen gods to get our salvation. We are going with the heathen Messiah to get our connection to the, Pemba, to, to the temple. This is the job of the secret society people since for 2,000 years. And they're lying to you because they don't want anybody to get into the day of rest. So they made up their education, they made up their religions, they made up all this stuff. They got you fighting in militaries for what? Sacrifice to these 2,000 gods. And then it was funny because Rome would play a trick on you. Oh, they would burn you at the stake for, for having multiple gods, and they were hypocrites. Rome itself is still worshiping those multiple gods. The Pope, or whoever you call him, he's now the same, not even the same guy, is still praying to all of these Babylonian gods, telling you they're the one, the Father, Son, Holy Spirit of us. It's like, that's why Tatan Samib is like, you hypocrites. The Most High is saying, these people are hypocrites. They're acting like they're praying to the one God when they are still praying to many gods. And they're telling these people out here they're not doing that when they are. They're telling you they're not sacrificing to M-O-L-O-C-H, and they are. Okay? They have taken in Zilla Congo a Bantwe. All that means is the way of truth of the Most High's kingdom. They put it into English translation, the people of the way. They have those people still today. They think that they're going through Yakubi. 
Lucifer still messing with their head. The Christians think they're talking to the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. There was nobody named Abraham. There was nobody named Isaac. And there for sure was nobody named Jacob. These are names that are made up by Esau. And there was nobody named Israel. Once again, Israel is how Esau steals the birthright. So to refer yourself to as an Israelite means that you are calling yourself an Edomite. Yeah. Do you think the Masons, the secret side, don't know that? Yes, they do. The Masons know that very well, that Israel is referring to Esau. Isolele, Isolele is the one that he says, I love. This is why they're teaching this lie in the English languages. That's a trance. And then you think that most I speak in English up in the crimson. <laughs> he don't speak Italian. He don't speak French. He don't speak Spanish. He doesn't speak uh, Chinese. He doesn't speak any uh, Russian or any of these other languages. When he's in, when he's induced, when he's referring to his court. Okay. Even those who speak the most high language come up there. It looked like a stupidity because they said, wait a minute. Who was I praying to? I told you. You think Lucifer can't speak Kikongo, Chiluba, Lingala? You fool yourself. You can say, Yusuf won an zombie all day long. But if you are in a pagan mindset, you're going to look stupid to, to them. If you're still bowing down to Esau all day long, okay, because Esau is the king of all of these 2,000 gods. Cain. There's only two temples, and most of you are defiling the temple, which really is the earth. Now it must be cleansed again for good. A lot of these people are talking about, we're going to do rapture. We go, Esau created this doctrine so his brother would be stupid. Okay? You are Messiah. Ha! They want you focusing on one guy all the time. When Kusa Kongo said, I want many like me. But then when you're when you're like him, they cannot charge you the same way. They cannot treat you the same way, and you have they have to pay you, not the other way around. This is what you don't understand. They have to pay you, not you pay them. So many people have no idea that the title that they carry on themselves is completely fabricated so that they can profit off of Jacob, Yakubi, Isaiah's trouble that started a long time ago. And they got you going in circles. Oh, this is the beginning. Of, man, you don't get it. Y Jacob's trouble should have ended in 1984. But then you got all the infiltration of all the people, even the Tokwis, the Kimbanguis, the Catholic, all of these religions, okay? Making backdoor deals on you still. With people who are not even the right bloodline telling you they're Maya Mona. They're this, they're that. Not even the right bloodline. And you believe in it using the sorcery. They're talking to Kimbangu and it's not even the right bloodline. It's not about race. 
they t they made the black white crap to make money <laughs> and to do damage you don't understand this you're looking up to people who won't even be able to save themselves at all wait till you see it whoa we got duped now they're starting to realize it white people got played oh my gosh they don't even know they got played they got all these promises that they've been given and then when they go to the other side huh wait till they, they wander <laughs> They wandering all over the place. Do you see me? Oh, help us, help us. We don't, we got the bad, the bad deal. Yeah. They got a, they all, all of them, prayed. you don't even know. They're going to find out. Oh, we prayed to Anubis. Oh my gosh. All the white people, my son. Praying to the dog guard with the mask on, with the bingo, ha, 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 ha. laughing at them, laughing at them, and then they're laughing at you too because you down there praying to the Egyptian god. Hey, Takazami, clean comb, hallelujah. The Masons know you praying to the the stupid dog. And the stupid cat that they now saying they hasten them eating. <laughs> Do you want to know how long they've been eating cats and dogs? And who does it? Oh, it is a Canaanite, Canaanite worship that they have always eaten the cats and the dogs, and they don't, and they eat other things too. The whole reason why the Most High created the dietary laws has nothing to do with what they're telling you. It's what he created the creation for. And then they had the unclean things. You're going to find out there's animals. The Tanzambi did not in create the house cat. <laughs> okay? And all of these little versions of little doggies are actually not so-called evolution, but they were made. <laughs> they did They did all the splicing and all this stuff. Oh, we just now started to learn how to do that. Oh, McFly, McFly, McFly. McFly means son of Beelzebub. <laughs> okay? You don't understand this. There's no such thing as evolution of nothing. The Anunnaki playing the oh yo yo God the world is gonna be fine. They're gonna find out you praying to these gods that were making changes, unclean animals. The dog came from Tatanzami for Cain for protection. Now he using it. <laughs> He doing the most debauchery thing with the dog, and then he do the good thing. He blend um the cats. Man, you don't understand. Okay. As people are now discovering, this is the way the fallen spirits can come and pay attention to you and play games. You bringing Lucifer into your house when you're adopting that cats and dogs and you don't even know it. And he know how to make them pretend and everything. Where do you see that you're bringing in the Egyptian god and goddesses into your house every day? Yeah, they look, oh, they live, they make you live longer. Man, you better pray, pray over those animals, my son. I done telling you. you. You better get the spirit that's on them because the Egyptian goddess is on the cat and the Egyptian god is on the dog. Hey, you don't understand this man. You don't know who man's best friend is all about Cain. And then, of course, the feline side is Kisha, Kihisi. 
which they really didn't the fun of called dog bone. That's when the cats and dog they fighting each other. And sometimes the cat chased the dog, and then the dog chased the cat. That's the yin yang twins right there. Okay? Yeah. Everything is about a deception. You are the cat. You are the dog. They're laughing at you. That's why they mock it in the planet of the apes. We the apes, and they're the cat and the dog. The other nations are the cat and the dogs. And they're mocking you with the, with the with the TV show Dogs and Cats. You the dogs and cats. You the cattle. You the, you the sheep that going the wrong way. And going, going, what they say, and going, okay. You know that's why I read. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to uh, do Proverbs 22. A good name is rather to be chosen than great riches. Nobody, and I mean nobody, is choosing a name that the Father approves of if they don't know how to use language. The right way. This is why they had to erase ours <laughs> and change them because they know this and loving favor rather than silver and gold. Why do you think they had to lie to the Christians and say, if my people who are called by my name? And why do you think you have all these agents that are dodging it? what name you should be called by. And even if they say it, they're still a hustler. You're going to see this. The rich and the poor meet together. The informal is the maker of them all. Okay? So that's why they don't tell you about Second Ezra. Those who come from like Adam are like unto spit. What, the, what makes you like spit is when you exploit or you abuse his kingdom. A prudent man foresees the evil and hides himself, but the simple pass son and are punished. See, and that's what we're dealing with. You're getting left holding the bag. By humility of the fear of Mvuma are riches and honor of life. What brings you wealth? Fear of the real creator. That's why some of these Christians and some of these, they, they, they have a fear. Okay? They're, they're getting your riches because you keep lying to yourself. The only one that can give you the riches that you ask for is Tatanzambi and Pungo Tulendo. That's it. King Congo, Sonina, Nini, Somana. And how does that work? What does fear in the Most High mean? Obedience. Christians think that they're obedient to our Father. Lucifer is paying them by the billions to keep their mouths to not even know that they're being bribed. With trillions and billions of dollars, Lucifer's bribing these people, causing them all kind of harm and then giving them fake ways to heal themselves, making them go and engage in things they have no need to be a part of, and then giving them the alternative to what has supposed to be happening. And the wealthy people sitting up there mocking everybody. Yeah, it's about to be over. Thorns and snares are in the way of the forward, but he that doth keep his soul shall be far from them. Why do you think you got all of these people out here trying to steal people's soul? Now, train up a child in the way or he or she should go. Should go means according to the spiritual temple of the Most High, the Pemba Kalunga, Kalunga Nanzambi, the heavens, the Zulu. Okay? And when he is old, he will not depart from it. 
none of our parents in this system have ever been taught that, to do that and will never be taught to do that because they benefit from the fact that we disobey the Father by breaking the first commandment every single day. So then your prosperity goes to the other nations. That's why they don't want people to know the truth. When we as a band, that's why they don't want us to be together. That's why you have all the sabotage. When we really truly come together, your riches will return to you. You don't need to go find it. The angel himself will help you with that. Man, people just want to keep listening to, to a lot of these um, shysters out here. The rich ruler over the poor and the borrower is servant to the lender. Now the father is saying, flip, pow. This goes back and every single so-called Hebrew Israelite Christian, or whatever you think you call yourself, you need to go back to Deuteronomy 28 where he tells his people. But see, now you got the people who are saying, well, that's why we are the ones that should be lending to you and you should be borrowing from us. They're using Deuteronomy 28 for the banks. Let me show you. This is the banking system right here, Deuteronomy 28. Watch what he says. This is who they're saying that they are. And they are not fully obeying the Most High. Neither is a Christian. Neither is a Muslim. And Judaism, forget it. Okay? If you will fully obey the Infumu and, and carefully follow all of his commands, I give you today the Infumu Yerfumu will set you high above all the nations on the earth. Peep, man, by not be, oh, you're, you're the concern. Whoo, Father. Hallelujah. What did he just say? Why do you think now these people are saying we obviously are blessed? Because we are above the nations. Then why are they breaking the law about putting you in debt? Because you're not supposed to be. <laughs> Woo, boy. All of these bilaka will come on you accompanied if you obey the infumu. So what they're telling you is we are wealthy because we are in obedience to the Father. Uh, no. If they were, then why does the so-called Christian world have to supply what they have when the Christians themselves are supposed to be more blessed than them. You don't understand. Why does the United States have to get military weapons, a so-called obedient world to the God of creation? Why are you supplying stuff to, to Israel when the Most High can do it himself? He don't need you. He got weapons better than what you got. There's nothing Lockheed Martin or, or what you call them, Boeing or any of these companies can make. That you're going to see the most high got some weapons, boy. Oh, boy. Can't touch it. Yo, you, they can't touch it. Now, the fruit of your womb will be Belaka. Hey, wait a minute. The Jewish people have the fewest numbers in the world. Where is the multiplication here? Go look at the percentage of the people who are Jewish in every culture, and they are the minority. This is a fact. But they said, the Mosai said, the fruit of your womb will be multiplied. Your basket and your kneading trough will be blessed. You will be blessed when you come, when you got. Why do you think all the people are now saying, we got to make, they hate, they hate, the, they hate us. If you are following the Most High Law, Statutes, and Commandments, those who want to love him will draw to the people that are doing it right. 
So they're going to say, well, we're hated because we're following the true God of creation. No. <laughs> you don't get it. Now, now watch. Here's the biggest deception right here. The infumo will grant that the enemies who rise up against you will be defeated before you. Here's where you got to say, oh, wait a minute. Yo, okay. They calling all the world S off. This is what they're saying. So then why is the God of Israel not defeating S off himself? The Maliki Congo themselves will come and beat the crap out of these people for you. It says, they will come at you from one direction, but flee in seven ways. Do you see this happening? Do, are, the, are, are the enemies of Israel fleeing from them? Are the enemies of the Jew or the Jews fleeing from them? Better yet, are the enemies of Islam fleeing from them? Since they're supposed to be the most highest way. Are the enemies of the Christians fleeing from them? Are they running away from the Christian like, oh man, woo, it comes the God of creation? Are they running away from Christians? Hex, no. Why do you think Lucifer challenges anyone who comes to preach the truth? Because he knows when, when the Banabetu of his son are in Kintwadi, the righteous seed, your enemies will go goodbye. <clears throat> this is why I telling you people. If the Hebrew Israelites were telling the truth, all of their enemies would flee. If the Christians were telling the truth, all of their enemies would flee. You think they don't know who the people are? The minute we came back in the, together in the 1300s, it's like, oh my gosh. They're gonna, we, these people are gonna jack us up. Pooh, gone. They're like, uh uh, we gotta come in there and trick them to go back to the other way. The Tanzambi said, the reason why we even had to run away from these false doctors of devils is because as a nation, we never learned to stop bringing in the imposters. We still never learn. You have to come through, not be as they lying to people. They make your money off of it all. The Infuma will send Bulaka on your barns and everything you put in your hand, and the Infuma will Bulaka your land he has given you. This is the reason why a Christian going to tell me he's poor. You fooled by the wrong God. A Muslim going to tell me he's poor. You fooled by the wrong God. The Most High is among the poor. But your nation, you don't you see the poverty right now in Africa. What God are you praying to? Yes, there's other people who are. Do you know how those people really got rich? Wait till you see. All of that comes from uh, Mami Wata deception. Are there those people who may not be the, the, doing it right? Yes, they are. But they're always going to be the ones treated the opposite. Why? 
because you are in the world of materialism. And now it's all going to go away. You cannot profit off of what is not yours. Now watch this. The Infumu will establish you as a holy people as he promised you an oath. If you keep the commands of the Infumu your entire will walk in obedience to him, then all the people on earth will see that you are called by my name. That's why <laughs> the people who are calling themselves the chosen people right now, the Jewish people, Israel, what name are they called by? What is the name? Oh, it's God. It's Yahweh. We went. Yahweh is just the most highest way. Of what? Lies or truth? Sonini Nanini means I am that I am. Are these people called the Sunni Naninis? Or Ahaya Asher Ahaya? That's how they say it. And they will fear you. The Infuma will grant you abundant prosperity. What you're going to see now, people, boy, when Tata Congo breaks into the reality check, you're going to be seeing some fear on some folks very soon. When they discover who is it that is really the one that was going to prosper the house of the Banabetu of Isolele. You have way too many people of the wrong bloodline tricking you and robbing us of the inheritance that the Father gave us for free. When he come and he do Jericho and all these things, knocking down the walls, did you have to pay him for that? All he said was to be in obedience to what I asked you to do with your heart, not your mind, not your thoughts. That's why he said, don't use it by your head knowledge. Go by the heart, but the heart can deceive you when you do what? Focus on the wrong things. Everybody, and I mean... Damn near everybody's being distracted by these false gods and their thoughts. Tatan Zombie does not allow you to go hungry if you have not cursed yourself. And he have done things that is against what he asked you to do. But then that will also then benefit the other nations who then see themselves as blessed when they are robbing the temple. They are not feeding the the the, the eagle of manna is not feeding some feeling feeding people when 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 you do not have repentance and cleansing of heart and soul and mind. You are being fed worms. Why do you think they keep talking about parasites all of a sudden? Yeah, you have to eat the parasites because you worship being the pig god. So of course you got played. See, the infumu will make you the head and not the tail. So guess what? The banabetu or the solele are the pin the tail on the donkey. We are the Anan C, the jackass, because we let Esau, Esway, and all of his false gods take what belongs to us. And we gave it to them. And they happily gave you what? Nothing but misery, pain, junk, 
working the tail off night and day. You go according to their schedule, not the most highs. You got the taskmaster still running the show. That's all your boss is. Every civil, every single so-called business that is being set up under their system, they know that the boss real title is taskmaster. To make sure that everything is flowing back up to the storehouse of Cain. And Cain is exchanging you garbage for nothing. Okay? He's made you materialistic. Focusing on the wrong things. That's why in every country that we live in, we remain under curses as long as we bow down the knee to bail. Begging and asking for what we... You don't even know. I'm stacking up hundreds of dollars, $1 bill, $2 bill. The, the father's going to put an end to all of that because you've already been under the mammon. Okay? They, they took the scripture that says, if you don't work, you don't eat, and twisted it for Esau's gain. Under categories of different religions and beliefs and all kinds of paperwork and red tape and everything that they've created on who gets what and who doesn't get what. Oh, but then when they can't find the money, oh yeah, uh, you know, this and this and that. Lie, they've been lying, they, they always, <laughs> you, they are never gonna fix the societies you live in they're always going to be empty promises because of who pays them in the pockets. You do enough to keep them, their mouth shut. That's all they do. <laughs> this is how it works. Keep the peasants off of our back is their job. That's what a politician is designed to do. Keep the peasants away from the people running the show. That's their job. They're complaining. Okay, here, here, here. Shut them up. Cry babies. Because you know you're, you're under the spell of that baboon God. Okay? You're like the, the you know, the birds that's sitting there waiting for the, pee, 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 looking for worms. Okay, okay, shut up. Okay? Give them the worms to say shut up. Okay, you 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 really don't get it. They gave you all of this nice stuff to shut you up, so you don't even know that you should be crying out, because they're devouring you. Like in the days of Noka, they were crying out, "Oh, the Tanzami, look what they're doing!" Yeah, they don't want that, so they're shutting you up. And then I'm the bad guy for showing you you should be crying out when they got you shut up and now they finally getting it they, they upset with me and people like me oh no he giving away the secret yeah because what's going to hit you now i can't even imagine you get popped upside the head i i boy <laughs> Woo! you you see people now drowning in hurricane and floods that should not even be happening to you. You do understand this. See, it says it right here. The Infumu will open the heavens, the storehouse of his bounty, and send rain on your land in season, and Bilaka, all the works of your hand, you will lend to many nations, but will borrow from none. This is what they're living. This is that whole Proverbs thing. They made, they twisted it, and now the lender is the rich or the slave to the lender. They're break, they're illegal right now. All banks are illegal. The Rome is illegal. 
the, the Babylon, everything is illegal. They know you signing contracts. That's illegal. But this is what they use law enforcement for. That's what they use the cops, the federal people to see everybody. They use the law enforcement to enforce illegal laws against the father. And they don't even get it. They have turned you into a beggar. Which is why many people commit crimes because, well, I want to have what you have. Yeah, they intentionally created a materialistic society. And even those who still think that, well, I'm living it the way, you know, I don't see nothing wrong with what I'm doing. You are always committing bazumba. Let me show you the word. This is what you do every day. Bizumba. All you got to do is kick off the B-I and there goes the, the, the thing you're dancing. Zumba, zoom, okay? Bizumba, adultery. And they're laughing at you. See? Neither must you commit adultery. En que fuerte sala en pibe bizumba. See, this is the thing. They think, Namitundo Mosi Baklistu. See, there's no word Christian. Take the uh, This was an L. Baklistu. Abantwe, really. Fuerte Mona Nzanzi Ngindu Yakelukula Nzambe Na Yehova Yepoa, really. MP Banquelani Nabo. Nakusalaka bizumba atakima ya kepusa bonakusala yokele inki. Which means what? Christians are creating, they're doing bizumba every day. <laughs> because they need you to be a, they need Jacob, Yakubi, Isaiele, to do bizumba, so when they go to Tatanzambi, what? You are, you are adulterers. You worshiping the stupid dog god, Anubis. The, the, the hawk god, Osa, what is your name? Okay, Osa, you worshiping Egyptian god, he gonna look at you like, what is this? I don't know you. This is what Esau wants. Every time you go back to Tatanzam, you look like a stupidity. That's because you, he don't like you. Because he was made to look stupid. Now you're going to look stupidity going back, idolizing people. Kuswa Congo said, it's not me, but the one who sent me. Yes, you honor him because he did not sin. Okay. Yes, we do the honoring of the people who did the most high's work. But it is not his spirit. And he don't look like no image of Jupiter, all this garbage. Cain. Cain was a black man. Oh, you don't even know. Let them keep lying to you. Uh, 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 Askenaz was a black man. Darker skin. What is this? Yapeta was a black man. Okay, yeah, Japheth. You don't. Ay, 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 got the word. Okay. They took the curse and they reversed it because of the Anunnaki liars. Jacob and the stupid, okay, demon, they lie. Okay. The halo dragon, the, the 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 fallen angels wear the halos. The real angels wear the crown. They don't. None of them, Licky Congo, wear no halo. Okay, and then they're singing about it. Let me see your halo, halo. 
and they got you singing with them. <laughs> you gonna find out, boy, I done told you this is gonna be the worst school year for teachers ever, very soon. Because more and more, the father gonna expose the lie of what education is for. It's for them, not you. It never was for you, it's for them. So that you go in the church, even the Christian churches are in, in cahoots. So everything you do is bizumba for the, the, you are a stumbling block. So that they benefit from those of us who keep doing the worst things to each other. And now the father gonna put a stop to it. <laughs> you don't even know. Okay. Whoo, Father, let me get the song out. Yeah, let them keep going to the Chinese and all everybody else. Oh boy. You you don't understand. Let me get the song going. I'm gonna sing today. Yeah, they don't want you to know this. Everybody's under mental illness of some kind on different levels. They think I'm crazy. Ha! <laughs> okay. You think that's how it was in the days of Noka? The crazy ones, they try to tell you, we crazy. Yep. Wait till you see what's going to happen to you. Then you're gonna say, oh wow, we weren't they weren't crazy after all. Yeah. Sakupan's Nzinga, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Nzinga. Nzing Azinga. Ilekiti. That means the Holy Spirit and a brother. Uh, Azinga. 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 Ilekiti. We didn't need to get taught to sing that right. No, Mazungu. What do you call Mazungu is any pagan or Gentile. We already knew. Ayenga. Ayenga means peace. Ayenga. Ayenga. We didn't need to learn that from no Catholic priests. <laughs> Lies. Or no, or no Protestant. Or no Orthodox nobody. We taught them. Look, they're killing us. They're still killing us. Zombies, uh, zombies say to Oko Zulu, Utuva in Samua, Tomakutu Kumikanga, Utequisa Zain, Zambita Talangape. Setizele mbubuwao Ubate mo wesa kaka Wa isa isa Vumu isu utufila Munenzile zuluwao Utulakis oko wino Koko ya Quincy That's where the word Quincy comes from, by the way. Ya Quincy, K K U Quincy, Ya Quincy. I'll see if I can find the meaning. Zambita ta talangampe setizele mbubuwao ubate mo wesa kaka wa isa isa kumbafu mutani etu ya wenkembe wangu wao. Konso oyo okuilaka okuilaka zambita ta talangampe setizele vubuwao ubate mo wesa kaka wa isa isa. Of course, it means my father knows. Yes, he does. Um. One on Zambi, Velelisa, I saw Fukayobi, Golozaku, 
Easy vava munanti ma miau Zambi ta 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 langampe seti zele mbubu wau Ubate mo wesa kaka wa yisa yisa Let me see if I can get Bayeti It's funny because Coco, I just saw the name. I saw that yesterday. People don't know what Coco really means. Let me see if I can get it to translate it. <laughs> Your chicken. Yeah, right. That's not what it means. <laughs> see, they're always going to mock it, but that's not what it means. Coco, let me see if I can do it individually. Cows. Cows. Okay, we'll see if that's really due. Mm, let's see if I can get the correct thing. <laughs> Excuse me. Samana Kulamba Mamadia. See? Madia. Food. Mona Vandaka. Madia. I gotta say it right. Kutum, Kutimona. The bulu sambu na kutula tia mpe mono vandaka kuyika kamfumo ya koko. Okay, sambu tia kupela ngola na ze coconut. But I know we have that connecting. Let me see if I get the word yaku. I might have to go to a dictionary. Your. And then let's see. In seam is like, that's like. The bottom or low or the earth base, like the base. So it's like a coco ya quincy. It's like that's why they use the word the quincy is another word for base. And see, Elon happens to be uh, named after base mass father, which is Esau's wife. Okay. So he's like, this is the, the people, he's like, for the, like I said, he's among the poor, okay? The, the base, the foundation of the earth, okay? So that's kind of the, 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 the rough interpretation, Coco, Ya Quincy, the base of the, you know, the, the coconut, the tree, okay? Um. The coconut tree was very important to us, especially when they make um, uh, the, the palm wine, which is really what we used to do. But the poison apple, yeah, that's what got us. That's why my doctor said it's more acidic than oranges. You don't even know. They want you eating all kinds of apples because that's what causes acidity. The acidity in your body actually causes the imbalance so they're teaching you stuff you're supposed to do. You're not supposed to eat them hardly at all, really. They, they're actually food for the animals. That's what they really were supposed to be for. That's why you're eating the tree. See, the apple tree was the food for the animals. Yeah, we weren't supposed to eat them. <laughs> okay, that's why you feed animals to, to horses and other cattle. That's why they see you as cattle. You're eating the apple like the horse. Because the tree of knowledge and good and evil made you think like an animal protection the way you do things that's why you have people now reprobate minded thinking more like animals than people and that's what they did because they worship the animals and you're still worshiping the animals they wanted you worshiping the creation because they know let's see hold on what just happened to it uh, sorry I was trying to get to the, the picture I had. The brother sent me. Let's see, hold on. Where did it go? Well, anyway, yeah, you know, this is it right here. I, don't feel what, I think I know what I need to do.
This is the picture he was that I pulled up. And don't think that there's not imposters there. There's plenty of them. Okay? They know what this is. And then they took it over with all the, the forts and the churches. Okay? Congo is indeed the center. See? Banza San Salvador means the savior. Why did they name it that? They didn't name it that for no reason. Okay, there's a reason behind it. All right. Anyway, all praises. Zola Quingi San Bololo. We give honor to Tatanzambi and Pungu for all that he's doing. Sorry to go so long once again. But like I said, the purge of the Enzoan zombie, I've, I played that song, many have heard it. One zombie, que se yimbila, inzo, inzo, yan zombie. Just because people are singing about it, just because people are talking about it, just because people sing these songs, just because people think they're praising the Most High, that doesn't mean they are. Understand this. We never learn. Okay? You do not sell the bread. And the chosen, we run things. But they want to, that's why they wanted to help. They want the whole world to help them to destroy the chosen. Because if there's no inheritance, they say that we keep it. That's the whole goal of the world elites. They have always wanted you to help exploit Yakubi and bring them to help Yakubi to be lawbreakers, not law keepers. And then exploit it the whole time. And the most size, he tolerated it. Now it's over. All right. Zola Quingi, Sambololo. Oh, I wanted to say this for those who did celebrate it. And it might be another way to say it that's more. But remember, I saw some imposters celebrating it too. <clears throat> so be careful. I saw some agents also celebrating this as well. Mvula Yampa Yakisi, the new year. There's a lot of Kemetis that are actually still acting like the, the Adam's calendar is theirs. So don't get it, don't get it twisted. Just like all the other stuff, they always hijack everything. You need to pay attention to who's who. Watch your inner circles. We are our own worst enemy, and we have a lot of people who are the wrong bloodline that know that they are still deceiving the whole world. Anyway, okay, just because one, they say they're Jacob doesn't mean they are Jacob. Just because they think they're Jacob doesn't mean they became Jacob. No. Understand that. That's why the world, like I said, he said, that's why I said, have I come down to deliver them out of the hands of Ingibiti and to bring them unto the land of good bread and land and fallen with milk and honey? They're not telling you where that is because they know that if you understand it, you shouldn't be having to exploit or pay for anything. And the other nations, they want to keep lending to us. And it's not supposed to be. And making us pay for something that we're supposed to be. That Deuteronomy has got people all jacked up in the head. You're selling the most high bread. I'm telling you, woo, you better check it. All right. Bye, Kembo, hallelujah. 